Uh, in the middle of all of this, you know, I, I did reach out to a few people that I do know that uh, that are Russian hockey players or have been and, and are from there. And and every I swear to God, every single person says, you know, this guy Navarov, who is the coach over there, who is making these accusations, is a psychotic human being. Now, he also played in the NHL for many years. He was drafted in the first round by the San Jose Sharks and became one of these goons in the NHL. Okay. Then went over there, got a job within the Russian Hockey Federation, and then became, I guess, Artemi's uh, coach at one point in time when he was young. Sure. And he is claiming that this all took place in Latvia. They reached out to the hotel where supposedly this took place. They reached out to Artemi's uh, ex-teammates and everybody. I mean, everybody is saying this guy is out of his mind for making these accusations. This incident never happened. Never right, so, happened. So let's just go back to maybe people who missed this or aren't privy yes. to it. Okay. So Artemi Panarin of the New York Rangers is going to be taking two weeks off after what most believe is a political hit piece by a writer in Russia who interviewed well, his a coach. A coach a co- in Russia. Well, but, the, but it was a political hit piece. By a writer who talked to the coach, well, right? Well, the coach gave him the, the right. stuff. And because what I have been told, that <laughs> that Navarov, the coach, the coach, paid a writer to write okay. this. Yeah. And even our tabloids are calling this a Russian tabloid. Sure, okay. And our uh, tabloids are, are saying that this is out of control and ridiculous. So this article claims that Artemi Panarin in 2011 at a bar assaulted a Latvian, an 18-year-old Latvian girl. That's what it is claiming, right? Am right. I right about that? Yeah, yeah essentially, so, yes. So now you say, all right, why would someone want to do this? Well, Artemi Panarin, outspoken about Putin. He is, In July in 2019. He does big, long article that I read uh, the translation of this morning where he basically, I mean, he, he goes after Putin harder than most people go after Putin that are from Russia because people are in fear of what may happen there, to them. There are no rushing athletes that even remotely come close to even saying what Artemi Panarin said in that July 19th interview. Not even close. This is unprecedented. As Molly Walker told me yesterday, this is essentially, and she put it in her article, this is uh, essentially unprecedented sure. as far as Russian athletes go. And most Russian athletes, when they do go back to Russia, you know, fall into line. They are uber patriotic, uh, and Artem- Artemi Panarin is not that he's not patriotic for Russia. Is that basically, in his words, not mine, and I'm not trying to uh, put words into his mouth. Is he just wants freedom for everybody? He wants he wants what he thinks what we have here, and that's freedom of speech. 